Hey guys, it's Laura from the Vlog Style Adventures. One of the questions I get asked the most is how I tuck my tees. Today I'm going to be sharing all of my secrets to getting the perfect tuck on all of your tops. I'm also going to share a few different ways to style button down shirts and how to get the perfect tuck on your oversized sweaters. Let's get started. First up, we have a simple button down shirt. I'm going to show you guys two ways that I love to wear these to make them way more flattering. First, we're going to tuck it. So what you want to do is take the line here and tuck it right behind your button. And you want the material here to be nice and tight. So hold that in place and then take the extra material on the sides and roll it under. This is a super easy tuck. And there you have it, the perfect front tuck for your button down shirts. Another way I like to wear these shirts is to tie them up. This is great for those oversized boyfriend shirts and looks super cute with cut off shorts. To do this, all we have to do is unbutton the shirt to where the button is on your jeans. So for this, I only have to undo two. Then you're gonna gather the material on the sides and tie it in a knot. Once you have it knotted, I like to pull the sides to loosen it up so the shirt can flow a little easier. Your knotted button down shirt. One of my favorite trends this year is oversized sweaters and lace bralettes. I'm going to show you guys two different ways that I love to wear this combination. First, we're going to tuck it in the front. Now the trick to this is tucking just a little bit of material. So grab it in the front and tuck the bottom edge right behind your button. And you want the material here to be nice and tight. So once you have it all tucked in, take the extra material on the sides and roll it under. Then I like to pull the material back to the center so just the button is showing. The perfect front tuck for your oversized sweater. I also love pulling my sweaters off to the side to show a little shoulder. When I do this, I like to tuck my sweaters off to the side. So you're just going to take the material on the side that you have your shoulder showing and tuck it in. Same thing as a front tuck, just use your thumb, tuck a little bit of material. Then you're going to take the sides and roll them under. The side tuck for your off the shoulder sweater. Next up, we have our long tunic top. I'm going to show you guys two different ways that I love to wear these to make them way more flattering. First, we're going to tuck it. Now to do this, we're going to need a clear elastic. This is my secret weapon for getting the perfect tuck and making it stay in place all day long. So what you want to do is grab the material and pull it all to the front. Once you have it gathered, wrap the elastic around it. And then I like to loosen it up so that the back of the shirt isn't bunched up. I like it to be a little bit more flowy. So once you have it in place, take all of that material and tuck it in. And there is your front tuck for your long tunic top. Another way I love to wear these long tops is to tie them off to the side. For this, we're just going to gather all of the material and pull it off to one side. Once you have it all gathered, we're going to simply tie it in a knot. This is how I love to wear them with shorts in the summer. A super easy way to tie up your long tunic top. Last but surely not least, we have our basic plain white tee. This one is a little oversized, which is perfect for tucking. Like I mentioned earlier, the clear elastic is my secret weapon to getting the perfect front tuck and making it stay in place all day long. For this, we're just gonna take all of the material and gather it in the front. You just wanna make sure that your seams are even on both sides. I also like to gather it right where my button is because that's where we're gonna tuck it. So make sure the material here is nice and tight. Once I have it secured, I like to loosen it up a little bit so that it's not pulling or too tight on the sides. Once you have it the way you like it, tuck it in. 
and this will stay in place all day long. It's amazing. Now you guys know my secret to getting the perfect front tuck. Another way I love wearing my oversized tees is to tie them in a knot. For this, we're going to do the same thing as the last time, but instead of securing it with an elastic, we're just going to simply tie it in a knot. And again, I gather it right up to where my button is and tie it in a knot. Once you have it secured, roll the edges under. And there's another easy way you can wear your oversized t-shirts. Thanks so much for watching. I linked up all of my alpha details in the description box below for you guys. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe so you never miss a video. I also linked up all of my social media and my blog so you guys could check it out. Stay tuned for my next video. Bye guys!